One way to memorize the vertex formula for quadratic equations with how-to explanations. This isn't about understanding a parabola or its vertex. This is just to learn the formula so that when you need to figure out a vertex, you'll know it. Of course, you can use this strategy for other things to memorize too. Vertex and parabolas, it looks like this. The high or the low point, maximum or minimum. Use your brain as a camera. Picture the word with the red dot and remind yourself it's there because a vertex is where two lines meet or it's the maximum or minimum of a parabola. When you see the word vertex, remember that red dot and you'll be able to remember what vertex means. Here's a trickier snapshot. Take a snapshot of the formula for finding the x-coordinate of the vertex of a quadratic equation. Here it comes. Hit the pause button if that's helpful. Can you write it down from the picture in your mind with each part? Or was that too much for the working memory? Humans vary widely in how big their working memories are, and your working memory will change depending on all kinds of things. Here's how to learn it if it's too big for one shot. And once you've got the vertex, we'll build on that for the quadratic formula in the next video. Trace and read the whole thing. x equals negative b over 2a. x equals negative b over, you fill it in. Your eye is a camera. Repeat x equals negative b over look at your mental picture fill it in Now, it's not finished until you can do the whole thing. Now, for the spacing part, when you can repeat the formula, it's gotten into your short-term memory, make cards or plan to print out slides and practice wherever you go. And the vertex is just the beginning. The whole quadratic formula is next, but you're already halfway there.